Welcome back to the channel guys, a Tuneport 350. Just getting ready to put this back in the car in one of the final steps. Obviously I'll put a new cam in it and everything. The original distributor in this was no problem. Here's the, the original distributor from this Tuneport motor. I wanted to put a new gear on it since this does have uh, a lot of wear on that gear. So instead of just buying the gear, I went uh, and ordered a whole distributor. You can get these on Amazon or even eBay. They're pretty cheap, 40 to 50 dollars. You can get the complete set. Comes with the gear, comes with the cap, comes with the rotor. I've used these before. They're not bad for the price. I've never had issues with them, but if you start to read the reviews, the others will tell you. Uh, the cap obviously is junk. It's supposed to be red, it's more of a pink. That's not the, again, that's probably cheap quality, but as far as the pickup goes, that seems to be decent. The housing on this is the exact same as the original that I took out of this 89 Camaro. It seems to be the same mold, everything is the same. Now, one thing I would do, like the others are suggesting, it's changed the internals as far as your um, your ignition module I would so my plan is to change the ignition module I'm gonna use my original since this this original distributor had no issues it worked fine again I'm just changing it because of the gear I got a new cam and I wanted a new cam gear in it um, so I'm gonna change the ignition module I'll swap that stuff over that seems to be what the failure is on these cheap models it is made in China, but overall, it's not bad quality. It comes packaged in the styrofoam in the in the bag, um, so it's packaged decently, so it doesn't uh, doesn't get damaged in shipping or anything like that. Again, it, it's pretty much identical to the original one that I took out of this '89 Camaro. Uh, comes with the gasket, comes with everything as far as a complete unit. Uh, Again, I don't see any issues with it, so I'm going to go ahead and use it for the price. That's not bad. I would say get a better cap and rotor for it. Um, if you're going to use the same cap that comes with this or rotor, it's probably going to be okay. I would change these, these screws. These are fairly cheap. I don't think these would ever come apart again if you put these on the way they are. Or at least use some anti-seas on them so you're able to take them apart. They're kind of cheap. They'll probably break or seize inside of the, the housing. So I would change those. Swap the ignition modules on both of these. Uh, so I'll keep my old one as a spare, just in case if I ever need it. Um, like I said, most of the complaints are the internals failing, which is the ignition module, or sometimes even the cap and rotor itself, since they are kind of cheap built. The rest of it seems to be pretty good quality. Again, being identical to the original one that came out of the car gear seems to be good we'll see how that goes uh, again I've left the pickup uh, coil intact I will get a better cap and rotor for it maybe maybe we'll just try out what came with it um, and see how that goes thank you for watching